questions from online only, and we ask that you follow these questions, these guidelines, sorry. Please ensure that your microphone is muted and only unmute when asked to do so by name. Please activate your camera during the press conference, particularly when you are asking questions to the players. To ask a question, please remember to use the raise your hand function on your toolbar and wait for the moderator to give you the floor. We'll start with questions in English and then go to national language. Um, so, Mikhail, um, can you talk me through your match and how you're feeling on the court today? Definitely. I started off uh, just as I had um, hoped I would. I came out swinging. You know, considering this being my debut for Grand Slam matches, I was extremely happy with the way I played the first set. I didn't let uh, the nerves get, get in the way of me swinging out. And uh, first set was was exactly how I had hoped the entire match would go. Uh, however, I got a little bit uh, passive, too passive. Uh, I fell back in the court. Um, the court position changed, and I lost the second set. And as I'm losing the second set, I I don't remember a specific point, but I start feeling pretty intense pain in my left leg on the outside of my quad, and. Uh, Unfortunately, that affected me jumping up in my serve and, and landing from my serve, um, which is one of my most important shots. And, and uh, you know, that being just gradually worse throughout the rest of the match certainly didn't help my chances. But, I mean, all respect for him and the way he picked the, his level up in the second set, it was um, very hard for me to play against. Uh, I had my chances in the second set to break him, obviously, but... Um, fell too far back in the court uh, and you know outside of the leg uh, the first and the second was really my opportunity to to push ahead uh, not to say that the leg wouldn't have happened anyways um, but but uh, that's what I'm gonna take away the positives from this match just coming out strong and then and then uh, you know taking with me what I can control great thank you for that and we've had a um journalists joined late online so just to reiterate um, please use your the raise your hand function on your toolbar to ask a question and make sure that your microphone is unmuted when asked to address your question to the player yeah. okay uh, frederick would you like to go ahead yeah sorry i um sorry i missed the first uh, question i couldn't hear it's not frederick i'm michaela by the way uh, frederick couldn't be here I thought um, that might be the case. Um, sorry if this is a, a repeat, but um, Michael, could you please just put a few words on uh, on, on how you um, experienced the game? Yes, um, I uh, I was very happy with the way I I started the match out, came out swinging. It was. Uh, Exactly as I had hoped, I would uh, start the match out, uh, and all nerves aside, and uh, you know didn't let that get in the way. And and uh, the first set, very happy with my my game, and and you know unfortunately getting a little too passive in the second set when I had my chances to break earlier in the set. Um, but uh, in the in the late in the second set, I don't remember a specific point. However, I started feeling some sharp pain in my left quad and. And my serve being my biggest shot, every time I push off land for my serve, you know, I couldn't really get my footing quickly enough to get to the first point. And that getting gradually worse throughout the rest of the match certainly didn't help my chances. Uh, but all respect for him, the way he picked it up in the second, uh, you know, uh, forced me back in the court and and uh, picked up his own level, which was... Uh, you know, very hard to play against. Uh, and then, you know, in the, in the in the third and fourth, I couldn't really push off, couldn't really land and, and get quickly to the next point. So it was hard for me to to uh, really have a game plan against a guy like that when he just cruises through his own service games and, and, I, and I don't really have a, a solid way of, a consistent way of winning my own. Okay, yeah, thanks. And please feel free to go ahead with any more questions. If there aren't any, then uh, we can finish the press conference there. Sorry, I'm not. Yeah, sorry. Uh, just one more. Um, I just wanted to know, Michael, what's your plans uh, for now? Like, what's the next, uh, what's the next tournament uh, you've got on, and are you staying in uh, Melbourne for a bit? 
I am actually figuring that out right now. Uh, I don't have a concrete answer, uh, given the fact that my schedule is a little bit up in the air with the, the whole world situation. But uh, I am hoping to return, you know, spend a few more days here maybe and then uh, return to the States uh, where I'm basing out of Columbus. So either head into a few weeks of practice or then just head into the next tournament, uh, which might be in Europe, which might be in the States. But uh, regardless, I'm going to have my leg looked at first and hopefully it isn't anything serious. And after that, um, you know, I might have to get back to you on my on my actual schedule and, and in the next couple of weeks. Are you nervous about the uh, the injury? Is that something you've been struggling with before, or how do you feel about that? No, it's, no. it was actually the last. Um, it was practice two uh, two days ago. It started. I landed from a serve, and I felt some burning pain, sharp pain, in, in my leg. I had it looked at, and uh, loosened up and everything. It was great. Yesterday, it was a little bit more sore pain, which is nothing usually I worry about, and then. Uh, today I felt it in the warm up and and didn't really you know I took some painkillers uh, uh, did my warm up and and didn't really feel too bad going into the match. Uh, however, in the in the th in the second set, um, it was it was pretty bad. Yeah, I, I I couldn't really put weight on it walking off the court either. So, it's not something that I've experienced before the specific injury, but hopefully it's it's nothing too serious. Yeah. Okay. Thanks very much. Okay, thank you everyone. We'll conclude the press conference there. Thanks very much, Michael. Thank you.